Sorry guys, um, he interrupted the video, that's why I always like to lock the door, and yeah, um, alright, so I'm going to bring you the Amazon rolls, um, um, I'm in the tub, like, in like the very bottom, where it says safety, alright, so um, before I get started, don't forget to like and subscribe, and don't forget to become a member of the Jasmine Angel team. So I'm to a peace family. Whatever. Um, anyway, so. I'll be starting on the animals. Um, Alright, dinner. I found to Yeah. Not here. Alright. Animal Jam rolls. In order to make sure we all keep Animal Jam safe and fun, we ask that you follow these simple rules. If we find that you have broken any of our rules, you may be suspended or banned from playing Animal Jam. Yeah. Really, Animal Jam though? It's so unnecessary. Oh. Yeah, it looks so unnecessary, guys. Why do they like snacks? Yeah. Keep the haters away. I get it. Um. Alright. Number one. Keep your personal inf information private. Never share any personal in personal information that you could com promise your identity that includes your first and last and home address, cell phone number, contact info, or Skype other message other message apps. Photos of yourself, where where do you go to school, even your social media info. Um Dots. Um, so I'll be starting that. Number one, your personal info should always remain private. Always say no to anyone who, who may be asking for information that is personal. Never make, never ask anyone for their personal info either. Number two, when selecting a username, be sure to select one that also doesn't expose any personal info. Number three, never share any fictional info such as credit, debit, or card numbers, or even redemption posts that award a membership. Number four, never meet up with, wait, never meet up with anyone one offline. If someone asks you to meet them, please report them. Please report that player. Tell your parents or trust your girl and slash or report them to Animal Jam. Number two, keep your account secure. Always keep your Account information safe. Never ever ever share your username or password with anyone. Never doing so could result in a loss of your game items. If you HQ will not replace any items as a result of a popular game account safety. And here's just like two little dots here. Number one is the only way your account can be can ever be had if if you have shared your username and password with someone. Number two is never share your information with a website that is sponsoring you. Gems, diamonds, sapphires, items, or membership in return. It is a scam. Providing your account information to these sites can result in, in the loss of your items and AJ and AJ HQ will not replace it. They should replace it. That is very unnecessary. They should replace that. Don't you agree? Please comment down below right now and if you agree that AJ HQ should replace the items you got like casually. Not really scammed or anything. 
Yeah, they should. That sucks. I would, I would replace it. It's been a little bit of selfishness there. A little bit of selfishness. I disagree with that. Alright, number three. Chat Safeway. Elysium is fun and safe place for all players from different things. It's beliefs and backgrounds. Cameron should always be respectful and kind to one another. Do you hear that? And there are these five little dots. Um, yeah, so. Number one! Player is found to be bullying others, being mean or using inappropriate, hateful, racist, and or vulgar language will have their accounts suspended or even banned permanently. Number two. Uh, okay, guys. Okay. Um, number two. Using nice and appropriate language like you would at home or in school. Number three. Never attempt. Never attempt to bypass our chat filters or get other players to say inappropriate words. Number four, treat others how you want to be treated. Number five is never approximate HHQ. You say, you work for HHQ, or you are related to someone who is, who is, or you are a moderator. Number five. Wait, wait, number four. Play fair. Always use the trade system or, or trade items. The trade system is designed to ensure you that the appropriately, appropriately to review the, the trade and are um, comfortable with it before trading. If you are not comfortable with the trade, then don't accept it. It is okay to say no. Number one. Wait. So there are these three little dots here. So, all right, number one is be wary to of players who ask you to send them something first, and they will send something back before to ask you to send them an item. So then, so they so they can try it, and then promise that they will give it back. Never two is never engage any fudge trading plus any e. Number three is appropriate role play is always encouraged, but any role play that engages in extreme violence, terrorism, and all of those nature subject matter is not allowed. Um, number four. So number four is play fair. Uh, did I already say that? Yeah. Um, Alright, so number four is DON'T CHEAT in all caps. Don't cheat. Never engage any in any behaviors that attempt to defraud the site and or trick other players. This includes impersonating AGHQ as well as attempting to a scam or curse other players into decisions that may regret. Um, so there's these, like, three little dots here. They're, like, little, like, colons and telling you, like, more, like, information. Perfect. So number one is don't, so don't utilize any progress to change or alter how the game would normally function to the game. 
I have two gain and advantage. Uh, e dot t dot attempts to duplicate duplicate items. Grant yourself currency or earn currency at a rate that is impossible. Number two. Do not sell items or accounts to a real currency. Don't sell items or accounts on sites like eBay. eBay scams everyone. Do not buy Bobby Murray Stevens. Um, yeah, I'll just answer that later. Number three is do not access the game files or any unreleased content. Um, last one is keep drama safe. Um, I would answer that off camera, guys. So yeah. Or maybe a separate video on that. All right, I'll do that. The last one is keep Jama safe. If you across, come across any players who may be violating the rules, and please report them in game. Number one is please use report system wisely. Number two is false reports can waste time. Moderators can respond on reviewing players who are breaking the rules. And number three is filing false report. And also need to use some of your account. And I'm wondering about that is the above list and substance to change and is a neighbor accessible or not to be for a combination list of rules. Please see the see the Animal Jam terms of service. You seem good judgment and enjoy your adventure, AJHQ. Guys, how can I read all of this to you? Oh my gosh, this is a terms of service. And it's a lot. I'll be reading you that. I'll be doing two separate videos on the terms of service and their private policy. So this will be a long time. Anyway, so so thank you guys so much for watching and sorry about the little bit inter interruption. Um you know I'm all funny, so yeah. So please like and subscribe and bye!